Today is July the 23rd. It is a Monday. We are in the Bronx, New York, with the matriarch of our family, Catherine Lenora English Farmer Robinson. Please face the camera and say hello. <laughs> uh, tell me when you were born and where. I was born October 16, 1930, in New York City at Doctor's Hospital. Doctor's <laughs> Hospital. Is this still in existence? No, it is not in existence. It closed no. up. And did you have siblings? I had a brother, Reynolds, and a sister, Melissa. And what was Reynolds' full name? Reynolds Lloyd English, Jr. And do you remember what year he was born in? He was born 1925, October 2nd. And when was Millicent born, and what was her uh, full name? Millicent Isabel, and she was born December 23rd, 1926. 26, so the next year, and then you came along 30. Yes. And that was it, no more. Yes. Mm -hmm. And you were the baby of the family, yep. and you were your daddy's baby until the yep. day he died. And my mother's baby elephant. Baby elephant. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what she called you? Yes. <laughs> I said, I said, now, Mommy, this the baby. And she said, yeah, baby elephant. <laughs> now, speaking of babies, how many children do you have? Six. Last count. Last count. Are you yeah. planning on having any more? Yeah, if I could make a lot of money, no, no, yeah, no. sure. Oh, yeah, there'd be magazine articles. <laughs> <laughs> Did you always want to be a mother? Yes, I started yeah. out wanting 12 children, but I cut it down. Cut it down. Reality set in. <laughs> <laughs> Thank goodness. <laughs> <coughs> Not soon enough. <laughs> now tell me about how you would like to be remembered. At the, at the end of your life's journey and... Your children sit around, your children, your grandchildren, your great-grandchildren sit around and they speak about you, your friends. What would you like them to remember most? My sense of humor. Mm -hmm. My <clears throat> love of family and friends, my loyalty to my friends, and my love of the Lord. Mm -hmm. And my greatest joy is being a grandmother. I never had one, and I always thought I missed something, so I wanted to be a grandmother. Mm. I wanted to give my grandchildren memories, and I did have that opportunity. I'm very happy about that. Yes. That you have done that. You yes. have created some wonderful memories with your grandchildren. How many grandchildren do you have? Fifteen. Fifteen. How many great grands? Five. Five. Wonderful, wonderful. I won't ask you to name them or give all their birth dates. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you very much for spending this time with me. Goodbye.